Hey guys, it's Jalen. Welcome or welcome back. I'm here today to share with you my update for lip service. This is a Pantastic Ladies Club project. It was created by Jessica and Amanda. And for this project, I like to work on my bullet sized, like bullet lipsticks. And I focus on mid to high end range in terms of price. And I try to use a quarter of my lipsticks. I may change this up next year. I haven't quite decided what I'm going to what I'm going to do, but we'll see. I may change it up a little bit. Anyway, how did I do? Oh, before I forget, the other goal that I set well, there's two goals I set for myself. The first is I'd like to hit that quarter use goal on a total of 23 lipsticks. So 2023, I want to do that for 23 lip products. I think I'm up to 15. So eight to go. And the second thing is, is I also work on a like deluxe sized lip product like this one I'll share with you in a little bit. So far this year I have finished one. I work on them to finish and I have finished one. I'm working on the second one. It's fine. So now let's talk about what can roll out this month. I actually have four. I've been working hard on these lipsticks. So let me share with you the two that I'm super proud of. The first one, they're both bright pinks. This first one is by Marc Jacobs. It is the shade Clara. So what are they called? Lip Marc, lip creme. Here is the shade. <laughs> this one was hard, but I did it. There we go. Aha, hit my goal on that one. Yay. And the next one is by MAC. This is the matte lipstick in Wasaga Twirl. This is more of a pastel pink. But, you know, it's hard, more difficult to wear. So there's that shade. Hit my goal on both of these. And I did hit my goal on two more. And I'm sorry if I'm being really weird about my nails. I just painted them and I've already messed them up. So it is what it is. Okay. The third one I hit my goal on is by Guerlain. It's the Kiss Kiss Shine Bloom in Petal Blush. There's the front of the lippy. And then here is the shade. You can see I gouged a little bit of, of this out with my teeth. <laughs> Oops, this is gorgeous. I love this. This was nice sitting in my purse. You know, it's easy to wear whenever you're out and about. I love this lip formula, love it. And the last one I can roll out is by Urban Decay. This is the Cream Vice Lipstick in Liar. And here is the shade. Here we go. So yeah, those are the four that are rolling out this month. Very exciting. So now I'm up to 19. I have four to go. I think I can do it. I think I can. I think I can. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and take these off so we can have a an accurate representation of what my current palette is for lip products. So let me share with you what I am still working on. And as usual, I, ha I will have pictures in the corner of my progress. Okay, the first one I have is by MAC. It's the Cream Sheen Lipstick in Modesty. And I do have some progress on this. I'm actually very close to hitting my goal. So hopefully this is one I can roll out next month. I do love this color and I love this formula, but it's a broken lipstick. Whatever. Okay, next up is by YSL. This is the Rouge Pour Couture, the bold lipstick. And the shade name, oh, what is it? Number 12, New and Congru. That's what it is. Could not remember. There's the packaging. And here is the shade. I do have a tiny bit of progress on this. It's such a pretty color and a beautiful formula. This is one I definitely want to get some use on because it is on the lighter side. So I want to work on that one and the MAC lipstick to kind of roll them out. This one may, this one may take a little bit more time because it, I don't have as much use on it. Next up from Smashbox, I have the Be Legendary Prime and Plush Lipstick in Level Up. I love this formula. It's so good. Here is the shade Level Up, and I don't think I have, I have a teeny tiny amount of progress on this. Teeny tiny. But this one I can continue to wear into the fall, so I'm not as concerned with this one as I am getting, rolling these two out. This is another one I want to roll out, and I'm surprised by my progress on this one. This is MAC 
Love Me Lipstick in Cherry Cherry. Whoops, forgot to show you the packaging. And then here is, well, there's a cat hair on it. <laughs> there's the shade. This one does stain a little bit. So there's the color. This is the other, a third one I want to get out as soon as possible because it's a very bright pinky, like ready pink, really. Red pink. The next two I have zero progress on, like nothing. I did not even touch these. I was focused on these other four. So these got zero love. First one is Tom Ford Lip Color Matte in Steel Magnolia. I'll eventually get use on this one. But like I said, I was focused on others. There we go. Beautiful color. And then the other one was, where is it? Oh, I just, I put it on. That's why. It's what I'm wearing today. And now I can't find it. Put it back in my lipstick bag. The last product I was working on other than my deluxe size is by Charlotte Tilbury. I think this is the matte revolution lipstick in secret Selma. So that's what I am wearing today. Here's the color. It's so pretty. Here we go. So those are the six lippies that were left. And then let me show you the deluxe size. I don't have any progress on this one either, which I thought that I used it, but I guess not. Tom Ford Lip Color Matte in Fascinator. So it's this teeny tiny little sample. This is all I have left. That's it. I, like I said, I'm surprised I don't have progress. But there's the shade there. Again, this is more spring, summer, so I need to finish this. So yeah, I'll share with you the items of focus here in a little bit. Let's talk about the four new lip products I'm rolling in. The first one is by Becca. This is the Ultimate Love Lipstick in the shade Mocha. And here is this gorgeous color. I love this formula, it's lovely. So now we're starting to get in some of the fall colors. Very exciting. Next, I have another lipstick from Urban Decay. This is the Cream Vice Lipstick in Rapture. Here, um, yeah, you guys know what the packaging is. This is gorgeous. Holy crap. Ugh. How have I not panned this before? <gasps> yes. Next up, I'm finally rolling in a Tarte Color Splash Lipstick. This is the shade Surf's Up. I have so many of these because I love this formula, but a lot of them are more fall shades. And so I was like, I need to roll one of these in. So there's the color and there is the shade. So fall, winter, you know, you can see the difference in the colors from up here. And the last lippy I'm rolling in is by Shiseido. I haven't rolled one of these in in a long time. This is the... Oh, what do they call it? Visionary Gel Lipstick in the shade Streaming Mauve. So here is the packaging. And there is the shade. I have used this a little bit. So you can see I did have this in a project, I think, to use 10 times. So I've used it 10 times, but now I want to use a quarter of what's left. So there's the shade. So there's my new little color family. And I think next time I roll something out, I'll roll in some darker colors. I almost pulled one in this time, but I was like, you know, it's not quite time yet. I'm still working on a lot of these like bright, bright colors like these three. Wait, these two, these three, these three would be great to get out. My little mini and the two max because yeah they are lighter and more spring summer shades so yeah so that is everything for this update i'm really happy with the new lip products i have rolling in so anyway thank you guys so much for watching hopefully you are doing well and staying safe please hit that subscribe button and ziggy and i will see you next time bye